All right, guys, so I'm studying on these door panels. Now, I got a new set of speaker pods coming in from customspeakerpods.com, and uh, they are going to be going to add a tweeter right here and a tweeter right here. Essentially, there'll be one in the corner here and one in this kind of in this hole right here. Um, Looking on the other one over there, you can see that there's plenty of room for that to be uh, to be out in the open. It's not going to necessarily be behind your legs. It's going to be kind of close, but it'll be fine. Now, what I got in my brain is, you see on these that A pillar, that's been bet that textured. It's supposed to be that brown color that that's that gray color there that's on the roof. See, it changes to that dark color. You wouldn't even know it. If I hadn't showed it to you, you wouldn't even ever noticed it. And uh, this one too, this is the wrong color. Um, and these pods are also coated with that same color, which means they kind of blend, except, well, the, the edges are still showing, but, um, but the colors are all the same. Now down here, you'll notice that the door, if you look at it, the door is black up here and then gray down here and then the pod is a blacker color on the gray see and that's definitely different colors so what I'm thinking is I could uh, paint with the, with the bed bed liner stuff the Raptor liner I could do this whole panel down here um, excluding this part here because this is padding so this part wouldn't be touched um, and it would just be from here over uh, maybe up in the handle probably up in the handle up, up in that way you know and then all the way over to that following that line and I would do the whole sign with that with that Raptor liner, the whole bottom portion, with the pod on it, and do the pod as well. So that would make this whole thing match up down here, and it would be the same as that. Now, I, that when we're looking at it with the camera, you can see the difference in those two. They're very different colors, right? With your eyeball, you can't see the difference at all. They literally look almost identical, almost. But you can clearly see it with the camera. It shows up a lot. And the uh, the color I'm gonna use is pretty close to that top color. So I think it will work pretty good. Make it all blend in together. And then what I think I'm gonna do here on the edge, right here, is uh, a bit of silicone. Just a, or, you know, a bit of caulk. Just run a bit of caulk around the edge and then smooth it with my finger so that it blends with the piece around it some. And then when I put the bed liner over it, it'll almost, if not completely, hide the fact that it's a separate piece. Um, the, the screws that you use to do this with, that they include in the kit, are, it has a recess in the plastic and the, and the screw is designed to be flat. It's still going to show. The screw will show, but the um, bed liner might hide the screws to some degree. But I think ultimately it's going to look really clean when I get done. So, I don't know. You guys tell me. What do you think? You like my idea or no? I can't wait to hear it all set up in here though. Because those tweeters are insane. They sound so clean and so clear. And I'm really looking forward to it. Let's see what we got going on here. So yeah, you see my leg is nowhere near. Even if I stretch my leg out, the one tweeter will be here and one will be up here. And that'll be plenty high enough and clear enough to um, to play. 
And the fact that it's off axis a little bit over here going this direction is actually a good thing because these tweeters are going to be very close and those are far away. So the tweeters being off axis on their side that's close to me are going to help soften those a little bit. And then these over here will be nice and bright because they're pointed more in my, in my direction. So the, the balance will naturally happen and it'll happen for the passenger as well. Um, so that's cool that 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 whole situation is good i don't know about this yet how i'm going to do this and i don't know what i'm doing up there yet but uh but this down here is happening the stuff's in the in the mail uh i'll be getting it uh the end of this week uh maybe the beginning of next week and i want to get started on it and it's going to be fun good times and I'll bring you guys along for the ride, of course, because, duh. I'm also going to be fixing this. This is my um, my my dash cam. I'm going to be doing something different here. Uh, and at least, at minimum, this wire is going to get, it's no longer going to be hanging down. This wire is going to get uh, tidied up. But um, I may be getting a uh, a rearview mirror situation, uh, digital rearview mirror, and uh, with a camera built in it to point to the front, and then hook up to a camera that goes in the back back there. So I have a, a, a digital rear mirror because my rearview mirror, look in here, you can't uh, ignore the fact that my phone's up there. Um, so you can't see nothing back there. You can't see anything. And that's because I have my back window tinted dark. So even only in the very broad, bright daylight do you see anything at that back window. It's very, very much uh, dark. And uh, at any time other than bright daylight, you can't see anything at all out of it. So I'm going to do a digital... I've had one in here before, and it held up really well uh, for a long time, but it decided to let go one day when I was doing, uh, when I was in a competition, and I was doing, uh, you know, my running my lane, and the, the base, you know, the base just, it, it just exploded one day. It was all fine, 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 then, boof, the screen blew off the thing, fell down on me while I was... <laughs> Yeah, it just exploded, man. It exploded. So I'm going to get another one. <laughs> uh, but yeah, all's well, man. We're going we're going to make this thing look look bomb. But uh yeah. Raptor line the doors and everything. Um all thanks to customspickerpods.com. So, if you guys are interested in letting me know, let me know. If you have any input as to what you think on the uh, idea of unifying the color down here to kind of match the color up there um, maybe I don't know if it's gonna be darker or not but it's gonna be fairly close um, that's my plan is for what it is I think it'll look nice and I won't even have to change anything else in the interior to make it match it's just gonna naturally pretty much match anyway and uh yeah let me know what you think peace guys